Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Uyi Stewart. In my day job, I am the head of data science at CGen Incorporated, formerly called Seattle Genetics, a biotech company that is a leader in the research and development of antibody drug conjugates for the treatment of cancer. My team applies data science to accelerate the drug development timeline. I am humbled today to join many other esteemed members of the board to partner with Bio and the entire team of professionals at Data Science Nigeria in their unrelenting mission to leverage data science to transform Nigeria and rest of Africa to impact the world. To Bio and Tony and the Adekombi family, I send my warmest congratulations on today's monumental event even as you continue to inspire and lead this steady climb on the ladder of progress for our nation and its young talents. A story is told of a young girl and her brother who lived on the north side of the family compound and dreaded the evening walk across a bushy pathway to the south side for the typical family dinner. The fear was so crippling that they only went for breakfast and lunch and would skip dinner. This went on for several days until their father noticed their absence. When he uncovered their fear of crossing the pathway in the dark, he intentionally went to get them on this particular evening and made sure dinner was served later that day. He propped his little girl over his shoulders and held his boy's hand firmly in his grip. As they walked in the pitch darkness, they talked about different things for today and the future. When they got to the middle of the pathway, the father intentionally stopped and intensified the discussion. With the children so engrossed, after what seemed like an eternity, their father gently revealed where they had been chatting and assured them there was no danger lurking behind the bushes. His effort worked like a charm. By his action, he removed the barriers of fear, availability, presence, and a steady hand. The next day, the little girl and her brother went off on their own and never missed dinner again. Today, with the opening of the first artificial intelligence incubation hub for AI startups and research, like the father in our story, Bio and Data Science Nigeria have removed the barriers of fear, availability, presence, and a steady hand by providing a dedicated workspace for young Nigerians who are bursting with AI-centric ideas to develop incubate and scale up their innovation at no cost. Furthermore, they will enjoy unlimited access to advanced AI working tools, the internet, daily academic classes, expert mentors, access to foreign scholarships and industry partnerships. Just as in the story, once the barriers were removed, the little girl and her brother got up the next day and never looked back. So right after the ribbon is cut, and all speeches have ended. The countdown begins today, not tomorrow, for the first breakthrough innovation that will captivate and transform Nigeria, Africa, and the world. Finally, I want to thank my former colleagues at the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, uh, William Sambisa, the Nigeria Country Office, and the Africa team for continuing the, with the vision that was started by the defunct Strategy Data and Analytics Group to ensure that we leverage Nigeria's demographic dividend and build capacity and human capital in this country. This is the key to the sustainability of global development initiatives. A fly-in, fly-out model will always be insufficient. To paraphrase the French writer, Alassane Ndor, to change something is to be in union with it, to be within it, to approach it internally. Remaining on the outside, you can never know something in its essence. Well, with today's official opening of the AI Hub, the doors are open, the barriers have been removed. Let the change and the transformation be unleashed by these bright and talented young Nigerians who will also learn to pay it forward for future generations. Bio and Tony and the entire Data Science Nigeria team you are today's unparalleled trailblazers who are building a bridge for Nigeria and Africa's tomorrow. So grateful for this opportunity. Thanks, everyone. Enjoy the rest of the event. Bye, everyone.